we'll show y'all how to be entrepreneurs. So I take y'all vision, I'll, I get a percentage of y'all company, and I grow y'all company for y'all. So I get y'all employees, y'all start a company, y'all start earning money, the whole nine. You know what I'm saying? So, are you not doing your assignment? That show you may interest me. Oh, I can't say that, man. Being honest with you. Um, okay. Next thing. And I don't like wasting nobody's time because I don't like my time being wasted. You know what I'm saying? So those who don't want to be in here, y'all believe me. I'm just straightforward like that. Like, I ain't going to cut no corners. I ain't going to bullshit y'all. You know what I'm saying? I come from the same streets y'all come from. Probably grew up worse than y'all. And I'm just being honest. Uh, I just don't like my time being wasted because I don't want to waste y'all time. You know what I'm saying? I know some of y'all probably here because they paying y'all or y'all just here just to be here. You know, so I'm looking at it like that. Um, you got your paperwork? Let me see your paperwork. I don't know. I left it. I got my, I left my binder actually in my car. So what you got with you? Excuse me. Larry and LaShawn. Put you out the bathroom. Okay, bring all the food. I got a rough draft, but it's not finished. You know, it's nothing that's bring to the table. Some to bring to the rough draft here, some to bring to the table. Bring your rough draft. Who not gonna let you? Where your cut? Who not gonna let you? The director, they can Come on, let's look at your stuff. You ain't got it, you say you ain't got it. Don't waste no time to walk in on this. Oh, I agree. That's a waste of time, bro. Oh, no. Y'all, but this is a little different. Basically, the assignment is, let's say you want to, let's just use something simple. What, what, go on. You see the faster property stuff, and I did, though. I just ain't wrote on paper, so I'm making sure I had it on paper, though. But I definitely did, though. That's what we want to do, like, faster property or whatever, so we can make business, right? So it basically finds out what you want to do. So let's say you want to be a real estate owner. You want to own buildings and shit like that. I expect you to go out there and find buildings in this area for sale. They got it for sale, sign, write the address, write the phone number down. You know what I'm saying? That's what I do. I own over 125 properties right now. You know what I'm saying? So it's like me showing y'all what to do, but it's like this. Like, if I ask you to do something, you don't do it, so you bullshit me. It's a waste of my time. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to waste my time coming up here. I'm just being honest. A lot of, a lot of you know, when you can't, get on, you can't get on the internet at, at the house, you know. Pick a bro down. Get on, on the internet, yeah. They don't want us. They don't, they don't let us do anything on the internet. Oh, no, no, no. We can't use that. What's the big brother? They only let us. Mr. T. They only let us. T. That's a regular record. A who? Record. Why you got fell? You, you, you got you got warrant. Yeah, All right, so we ain't put put you in this one. So y'all gotta let me know, like, man, look, I'm gonna be honest, like, you know, because there's only two of y'all that's here that was here from the last time. You know what I'm saying? Me, honestly, y'all, like, I know it is like wasting somebody's time. I've been in y'all shoes. I've been in programs like this where I ain't really give a fuck. I come in just to get a check and leave. Be honest with y'all, cause that's all it really is. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna sugarcoat it, y'all. From the first day y'all met me, I'm not gonna put sugar on shit. That's just what it is. Go ahead. All right, like you say, like you say, the real estate. We go out and find find a property for sale, put your number and stuff. We bring you which one? So I'm gonna take the property. I'm gonna start start your whole company. So let's say, what's your name? Damien. So Damien Real Estate Company. Right. I'm gonna help you start your own real estate company. Help you buy your first property. We, we split the dividends, whatever it come out to be, and we go from there. You know what I'm saying? But you got to do the leg work. I'm not going to do the leg work for you. I already know what it takes to get one. You know what I'm saying? So if you do the leg work, that shows me you're serious about doing something. So I'm going to help you get to where you got to go. That's basically what that is. You know? I, don't know, I don't know nothing about no real estate or no business or cars. I don't know nothing about that. I don't do that. But no, it's any, it's any company. So let's say you can do lawn care. You know what I'm saying? Anything you want to do, do any of that. But it, like, I don't, like, what's my option? Because I don't, I don't want to do all of that. The option is your own thing. Yeah, whatever you want to do. You want to own a record label. You want to own whatever you want to do. Like, that's, that's basically you control your own company. What if you go down here and I just fuck up your money? You ain't going to fuck up my money. <laughs> I'm saying, you know what I mean? I'm giving you real talk. I ain't going to let you fuck up my money. That's just real talk. That's, that's, that's real talk. If you, got, if, you got me, if you got me over it, I'm watching what you're doing. I'm leading you through what you're going to do. I ain't going to let you get to a point where you're going to fuck mad. Right. You'll never be in a process by yourself. Okay, so, so let's say I, I go get one, bring it to you. Okay, let's say I'm going to see it. I ain't got to have it. How am going to do that? You say you broke his head. Yeah, how am I going to get the, oh, the, 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 the purpose. That's the purpose. I'm going to venture capital. 
I'm doing all the investing. So you want to invest in all of these niggas? Nah. That's what I'm saying. You I get prime example. It's going to be who's serious. Right. Why would I bet? Prime example. Why would I invest in you if I ask you to do something, you don't bring it to me? You're wasting my time. I'm not going to invest in you. Right. You know what I'm saying? That just shows who, who really want to do it and who don't want to do it. Appreciate you, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's just what it is. And I'll give you a prime example. Like, I ain't going to throw a race car, but a lot of other races do this all day long. They don't do it in this community. The only reason I'm here in this community is because I grew up the block. I don't know. I grew up in about a racing course. You know what I'm saying? People ain't going to come in and donate no money and show y'all how to be entrepreneurs. They're going to send y'all ass to work. That's just real talk. Work this nine to five. Get the couple of dollars. Help my company become rich and that's it. I'm going to show you how we get money together. You know what I'm saying? So if you don't want to follow that road, then that's on you. I can't. I'm not going to push you to do something you don't want to do. Real car. Huh? Real car. For my car? Real car. Car? Business car? I need one for we leave. But the property I found though is right on it thirteen. I know I ain't got man, no paperwork. You bullshit me, man. I ain't got no paperwork. I promise you, but I ain't. I definitely, was, I definitely did. I paperwork, and everything. Man. And it was already open and stuff. Paperwork, man. I, I got you. Paperwork, man. So paperwork. What, what all you want on this paperwork? I'm gonna put in my Whatever notes. you think need to be on there. Whatever you think oh, need to be on there, show. Yeah. Any other questions? Huh? How long you been in real estate? I've been doing this for before I met you. Like 12 years now. 12 years. You know what I'm saying? 35. I would have been playing People don't get comfortable with it yet. You feel me? Because they all try to reach your stuff. Like, but is you comfortable where you at right now? I'll never be comfortable where I'm at. I mean, the only thing is, hold on, let me finish talking. Sit right. The only thing with, when people say be comfortable, like, I give a prime example, like, the more money you make, the more bills you accumulate. That's just real life. You know what I'm saying? You start, you start eating different type of food because you're making more money now. You start buying different type of clothes because you're making more money now. So you can never be in a situation where you're comfortable. You know what I'm saying? Then you got to think about what's comfortable. My comfortability for me might not be the same for you. You know what I'm saying? I didn't have people tell me, man, if I was in your shoes, shit, I'd be good. How? You know what I'm saying? Because now you just, you just there. That ain't me. You know what I'm saying? I like to move around. I like to do different shit. You know, so. Yeah, I'll be honest with you fellas, man. You know, you know how sometimes y'all wait for somebody to put you on and shit? And you be like, yo, the nigga put me on. I could rap. I could do all this shit. If a person put me on, I'm going to show them what I got. For some of y'all, this is that opportunity right here. I, I can't motivate you. He can't motivate you. He can't inspire you guys to want more in your life. You know what I mean? All we can do is provide something for you guys. If y'all want it, y'all take it. If y'all right. don't, you know, y'all keep doing what y'all want to do. But you have an opportunity now. I'm just saying, y'all have an opportunity. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know. You. This is the second one. I don't know where you guys were at the first one. Yeah, this is the second one. Yeah. So we just, we just testing this thing out. Trying, so what am I? Right, so what am I? Just, 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 I'm I want to be serious about the situation, but I don't know. This is your know, first time in this one too, right? So basically, yeah. this, this is how it basically go. But I had them do it. They got a list. They had got some paper, right? They wrote down every company they want to own. Record label, lawn care, real estate, restaurants, clothing stores, clothing lines. You write that down. Then we'll pick one that you're real serious about, and I'm going to help you get to that next level. Business plans. Grant writing the whole nine. You know, talking to my lawyer, have my lawyers come in here, set you up in the right state that you need to be, the LLC corporation, non for profit, stuff like that. I'm gonna need like, I'm gonna need like, a lot of All right, let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. This is real shit. You ever serve any folks? That's a business. A business all in one. That's real shit. You know what I'm saying? That's just real shit. You sold dope before, sold weed before. That's all. That's a business. You run a business. You making sure you got enough money to recover, right? It's a business. You make sure you got enough money to go back to the store and get what you gotta get. I know. Me, I know. Like, like you gotta talk about like all that grant and all. I ain't gonna understand. Like, right. So, so I talk to you on a level that you know what I'm saying. This is how I learn. You know what I'm saying. So let's say that's you simple shit. Let's say you got a 16, right? Right. From a 16, you gonna go to an eight. 
But you got how many 16s you gonna sell before you get an eight ball? Real shit. Cause some, yeah, you say two, but real shit, most motherfuckers sell 20 16s and then go get eight ball cause you're like, I'm gonna be cop, I'm gonna be cause you spending your money on other shit. Right, right. That's how business is. So if you steady spending your money on other shit, you'll never get to where you gotta go. That's what motherfuckers been nickel and diamond for 40 years. Still on the same corner selling niggas and dime because they can never, because they ain't never saving no money. You doing just enough to go get gym shoes, go out Friday night, go kick it, have fun and shit like that. And then you're going back to the store. Now your man's looking like, damn, gee, how long you going to be doing this shit? You going to go to the next level or what? This is real talk. How long is it going to take to, I mean, how long is it going to take to, how long did it take to get up out of here? To get up out of here? Yeah. The hood? No, out of here. I have a fist of power. I don't know what this is. With, like, I ain't here. So you want to live in a program. Right. Chicago career. Right. Like, right now, we're talking about it. Right. You know what I'm saying? He's basically saying, like, how do we, like, once this, because this program is going to be over after Labor Day. Okay. He's basically trying to get permanent employment, right? Right. So you saying so how long would it take for really for you to make some money? That's what you really it all it all depends on what what, what, what type of company you got. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I'm sure you made shirts from the boot. They 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 sold out, but we can't do nothing. Don't know what else to do. Right. Why don't y'all just make more shirts? Have you was doing that those shirts with the RS? I was doing that, yeah, yeah, me too. How many of you guys did those uh, shirts? One, two, three, four. That's what was with me. Yeah, yeah. So y'all print it. Y'all know how to run silk screen and all that. That's what y'all yeah, doing. Yeah, yeah. But, but we got off on the basics. Photoshop, you know, right. Illustrator. You know, the silk screen, we don't know how to use the machine, but we know the, the idea of The application yeah, and all yeah, that shit. Yeah, it's easy to work. Yeah, it's easy to work. Yeah, yeah. We so y'all know how to do all the computer, Photoshop, yeah, do all the design and Before y'all like leave, make sure y'all put your names on the list for me. Alright, all right, come on. Yeah. Well, reason for that is because we actually opened up another warehouse in Calumet City. We're about to open up a t-shirt and printing shop. Oh, come on, let's go. So, that might work. But the, to be honest, the ones that had homework, that was their first test. You know you guys failed that one, right? Y'all failed miserably, man. Miserably. Yeah. This is the thing though, because I didn't put on pictures. Excuse me, man. I was about to say, you're giving excuses, man. Nah, you're right, you're right. Like, that's you excuses. Shit. Yeah. I ain't doing this, didn't do it. I mean, I made a mistake. Can I get that opportunity? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Be honest with you. If, if that I'll, is, no, I'll give you a prime example. Fuck it. I'm going to talk y'all language, because I already know y'all language. So, if I gave you a whole thing, right, and you fuck it up. Do you think I should give you another opportunity? Yeah, no. yeah, I agree. Alright then. That's real talk. That's just being honest. You know what I'm saying? Are you gonna, how, many, how many times are you going to come and be like, man, can I get another chance? Can I get another chance? Can I get another chance? Please, can I get another chance? Like, that's crazy, man. Like, that ain't, that ain't cool at all. But now I feel like, you know what I'm saying, that was a waste. You wasted my time. I mean, I'll just ask for a simple thing. You know what I'm saying? It ain't for me. It's for you. It ain't, I ain't telling you go do something for me, for my benefit. I got secretaries and shit. I can make a phone call. Look, go find me this and go take care of this. And it's done. I ask you to do something so I can help you out. Not to help me out. So now it seems like you don't want to help yourself. That's real shit. So, what's next on the agenda? What we got? Alright, so. Um, let's see. You did it on Law Depot? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Let me see. What type of company is it? It's under the T-shirt. T-shirt. A friend company? Yeah, a fashion. Yeah. LP fashion. Yeah. Oh, let me show you the um. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not sure. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. Yeah, nobody yeah. wants them shirts, man. My beard, nigga. See everybody wearing that? Nobody wants them shirts. This, this is what we need right now. Okay. This one. Nice. Yeah. I like that. Uh-huh. Actually, you, do the, uh, you, know, you can't sit on the can't yeah, be a boy yeah, they, directly. They just did it so everybody can get some. Uh, so so they really sit, sit. But it's over. So I'm going to put something together. Oh, yeah. I need this shirt? Yeah, we did this shirt. One of them. That shit. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
That's the fire one. No, that's the fire one. Oh, so. I, I was like, yeah, yeah, nah, it's just pretty good. Yeah, yeah. I know the shirt, shirt coughs. So I know all of that. I was going to add all of it to it. And I'm, and I'm on the right track. Yeah, you're on the right track with this. Okay. So when I get done, do I bring it to you? Print it out. Print it out, bring it to you? Yeah. You print out bring to me, then I have somebody spiffy it up a little bit, and then we'll go. Then you start your business plan. Okay. But this is just a proposal to get you going. Okay. Okay. So, like, uh, would you would would you advise me to just um, open up a clothing store, like a clothing brand? Because right now that's what we got. Clothing store. store. Reason I say clothing store because this the, this the problem with a lot of clothing brands they don't have nowhere to put it okay. to make no money. So you don't get a lot of people in the hood that'll buy your shirt because they know you, but then how much money you gonna really make? Cause they everybody gonna ask for a damn discount. Okay. And to being honest, okay. you tell somebody you got twenty dollars shirt, man, I can't get two of them for twenty. Yeah, right. You know, so you really losing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So you gotta look into that. Okay. So um, did I do? Did I do? That? You did good. You, I give you that. You ain't lie. I give you that. You did lie. Say it was in your kind. But I ain't know if I can access it. <laughs> I don't know if I can access it. That's good. I'm with that. You know you fucked up. I don't even know why you keep looking up. Yeah, you looking up. I don't even know why. You guys got fucked for this? You guys got fucked for this? Ah, yeah, let me get you one. Let me get you one. I'm gonna run out. So when can this start? Because a lot of these things, if people come and gas us up, don't never, nothing, never. No, I ain't even gonna flex to you, real shit. Man, I've been bad and came back. No, I ain't gonna lie to you. Cause I ain't getting my real shit. I'm gonna be wanting that. Cause I really talk about it. Be wanting it. Yeah. So a lot of times they get that bro, and you know what? Can't say all. Now come back. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna wait on them. I'm gonna stop having some Get what is mine, Joe? Uh, y'all records? Right, 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 right. It's the other side of the shirt. Oh, ain't heard much of this. Boy, it's a lot of things. I ain't throwing no shade now. I'm just saying what it is. But I definitely respect you for the fact. Yeah, I came back. I was gonna come back. Like, see, this is my thing. Like, I ain't gonna waste nobody's time. Like, I don't have look. See, and a lot of people that probably came up here wasn't from around here. I'm fucking from around here. A lot of people wasn't from around here, so they probably did. You know what I'm saying? That is real talk. You know, but for me to show that, you say what? Oh, Rob, you said some shit. Oh. Yeah, like, you know, like when they say, when they do all that stop the violence, walks in the thing, they ain't walking in the hood. Ain't none of that happening. You know, so, that's just what it is. So next Wednesday, well, I ain't gonna be it. I'll be what? I'll be in Turkey. I'll be in Turkey next Yeah. So the following Wednesday after that is what day? All right, so, so I got a question for you. What do you guys want from us? Like, what can we provide for you guys that uh, help you in your process? Uh, right now, you could, for me, um, you could provide, you know, because uh, I can't afford some of the stuff. I can't afford, you know, I can't afford to get my shirts printed, you know. I can't afford. Uh, so they don't let y'all print stuff up in here? Mm-hmm. 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 No, no, no. Print, print what? Print, print, that's it, dude. Print papers? No, no, no. Yeah. Shirts. No, no. Oh, you're talking about print shirts? Well, they don't even have equipment here. All right, they don't have equipment Look, to print shirts. Yeah. I think, I think we should all have our own. I mean, because we all try to do shirts. We all want to do so. We, it's like, it's at least six, seven of us. Because I, 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 I got most of the equipment here for this. So I feel like we got a better chance on it together than alone. I was thinking right, you do have a better chance doing it together than that. Right, yeah, yeah. As you put the equipment in Cal City, you know, the way I'm in this I was going to say, uh, I just want to have two of them. Maybe we can get together and do something. You want an opportunity doing what? You ain't dead. She was, what opportunity do you want, man? Just gave you an opportunity. Right doing 113, it's a whole crib right now. You just need to be gutting out. Man, take a picture of the crib. Oh, well, you know, I ain't putting nothing on paper and shit. I'm just all in here, man. I ain't tired of them, but I, like you said, though, paper going to say it's going to make it look better. So, you know what I'm saying? Anybody trying to get any construction, like real estate, learn to put drywall? Y'all talking to Nehemiah? Nehemiah Beard? Yeah, Nehemiah says that. You're not here today, though. Destroy the whole thing. Destroy the whole thing. Oh, oh, dude who was living at the house, they wanted the guy was blown sitting next to him. No, that's my kid. He got a whole little, what's his name, y'all? Like a whole little, he ready. But they, 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 they,
Business. I got something now, like you could be working now. Like I got property that I got people working in. I could just put them in property to work. Okay. Like, I ain't, I ain't. So, uh, Any of y'all trying to learn that stuff or no? Uh, yeah, I'm like, uh, real construction, real estate, like, yeah, yeah. drywall, mud, tape, yeah, doing right. carpentry work, stuff like yeah. that. Is it a, is it a um, yeah, certificate? Yeah, it's, yeah. it's different, different. It, well, I'll yeah, probably get him a certificate cool. for that. Yeah. For doing drywall and stuff, yeah, yeah you get him a certificate. Right. I got a few contracts. You say, well, yeah. 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 What's your yeah. angle, man? Cause you, you, what's your angle? What you trying to do? Yeah. 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 like fuck it. I just need a job yeah. right now. Huh? Business. More business. Exactly what you want to do. Did some of them come by the warehouse? Yeah. Did they come by the warehouse? Yeah. Oh, you yeah, came by the warehouse? Yeah. 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 Y'all came yeah. by the warehouse? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he was at the warehouse. Yeah. 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 I was thinking yeah. that though. I was seeing you somewhere. Yeah. 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 Oh, that was wrong. That's him. I grew up doing that. Oh, I ain't really wrong. That was him. He was the last one there. That's why I asked you. I was like, I seen you with someone last time. He said it up for the 28th to 29th. It was only the people she picked. Remember, it was only like six people because everybody else wanted. What, like 30 of you guys? It was 30 of y'all. Yeah, 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 it was 30 of y'all. What else you do, bro? You look good. No, you look like a basketball player or something. I mean, so, uh, I know when I was in uh, the music industry. Uh, okay. You got my card. Though. Yeah, just call. Hmm? No, I got you. Just call me. Just call me. I got you. So, so, like, I work for it, baby. What clothes are you got? So, you know, all that other cop place where you at, right? Huh? You know, all that other cop place, right? No. Yeah. I am. Damn. Yeah. I just wasn't there. I was out of town. That day. Was out I was out of town. I traveled a lot, so yeah, I was out of town. Yeah. This man right here. They definitely said he young. I don't know if you look dead at him. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I am young, though. Oh, so all them came? Yes. Yeah. I ain't know who all came. Yeah, it was yeah. 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 I'm having another, uh, actually, it's a forklift certification. You know what I'm saying? People ain't just gonna come off the street and just buy anything. You know what I'm saying? Then I put you in tune. I got a guy who got, how many clothes? Two? At EA. Mm -hmm. He got two clothing stores now. Then I got another guy who got a clothing store in, uh, called Rock Island. So I put you in tune with them and they can show you exactly what steps you need to do and what clothes they got in there, what accounts they got. But sometimes you can piggyback off of them. Yeah. That's who showed y'all what to do. That's that, uh, version. All white. All white. All white. All white. Yeah. Yeah. Um, he, he was building the same wire as you feet. Right. So, who all, did y'all get jobs with him or y'all just training? Uh, it was a little bit of both. Because he can, like, go to the store and get, like, have discounts or whatever. So I'm saying after this program, I ain't y'all able to go work for him. I guess that's the question. Uh, no, no, no. Hell no. Nah, no, virtually. He ain't going to pay no more. 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 He don't actually work for uh, RGP. Uh, John C. owns it. Oh, yeah. Right. So he don't have to pay no more. So he just put his clothes in his store. Oh, uh, okay, okay. I see what you're saying. Uh, uh, I'm talking about active, right? will sell blank shirts. Yeah, I'm looking yeah. down there, too. How yeah. much will we have to put forward? Wait, say that again? How much will we have to put forward? 150 fucking percent. It's your company. How much money is it? How much money is it? Nothing. So where can we start? When you do the assignment, man, like, that's the thing. Like, this is the thing. But this is the thing. Like, 
If I give you an assignment, I'm, actually, I'm telling you to do an assignment for a reason. You know what I'm saying? That shows me how serious you are that you want to do something. I'm not going to say, okay, well, come on, you're going to open a business tomorrow. For what? Then, then next week you don't show up? That's a waste of time. To own a, a company? No, I'm talking about what you No, I'm talking. All right, I'm going to get to that. But, like, from, like, how you come here, right? Right. All that we do, the business plans. Uh, how long do you think it'll be before we start? I know it's going to take us some time to do it. To start making right? money? Yeah. Within six months? I think most of them. Yeah, yeah. In six months. Yeah, go on. Yeah, yeah. That's what I think. Yeah. Start a company, what? We just started a company, what? January? Yeah, we started overnight. Making money, so it's so look. This is the salmon all I ask for. Next time I come, I written down exactly what y'all want to do. You owe me a whole goddamn paper, don't bring me shit else. I'm just telling you now. Like, write down a list exactly what y'all want to do from owning a clothing store for doing a t shirt line for whatever, whatever it is. I don't give a fuck to be an astronaut. Write the shit down, we're gonna go from there. So that's what, the 20 what? What's that? The, uh, 28? The 28th? Is that what it is? No, 28th would be out at the... Uh, anyway, see, no, that was decent though. See, it might see. Even though it ain't right, I'm sure. So. Yeah, you know, I like that. Hold on. 28th of Monday though. Yeah. 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 So I'll be back. Yeah. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. I'll be back on the 23rd. I'll be back on the 23rd. No, the following Wednesday after that. So y'all get it? Yeah. I ain't worried about it. The next time when I come, I'm going to ask who got it, who ain't got it. I'm just going to ask them, can you escort them out the room? Ain't no need for me to waste my time talking to them. Write down exactly what you want to do. So like if you, let's say you want to own a line cap service. Or he say a t-shirt come to your clothing store. Do some research on it. Man, these are many clothing stores within my area. What location you want to open a clothing store in? Why do you think that's a good location for you to open a clothing store in? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. All this is on the internet. You could Google 90% of this shit. You know what I'm saying? Me personally, on the 23rd. Me personally, I say when y'all do research, like if you want to open a clothing store, me personally, I say a good place to open a clothing store is right next to an expressway. Because it's easy to get on and get off. You know how many cars go through an expressway daily? A hell of a lot. So picture how many potential clients would come to your store. That's something to think about. You know what I'm saying? I mean... Because I'm from this area. I'm from this area. I'm going to be honest. Like, I'll give a prime example. Like, I told them, like, I grew up without a mother and father. You know what I'm saying? Both of my parents dead. My mother died when I was two. My father died when I was three. I sold dope when I was 25. It was 10 years ago. Like, anybody from over there know who I am, know exactly what I did. I still got family that live over there. I've been homeless. Didn't have to go from chick to chick to find a place to live to wash my ass out for the time. I've been down that road so I know where y'all are coming from. So when Savante came to me and, and T and he was talking about it, I'm like, damn, I want to help out. If I could just take three of y'all and make y'all millionaires in six years, I'd rather do that than take nobody else. That's it. Ain't nobody give me this opportunity that I'm giving y'all. I'm giving y'all the opportunity. And no bullshit. Like, I know a lot of people probably come here and blow smoke up y'all ass. I ain't the one. Because I got time. I'm not going to waste my time with y'all no more. I'm just being honest. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people like, see, and this is the thing, like, it's such fucking stereotype as like, why don't nobody come back to the hood and grab nobody? People then became NBA stars, basketball, all this shit. Why they don't come back to the hood and grab y'all? Because prime example, one thing. We talking, motherfuckers on their phone. You know how irritating that is? No bullshit. When y'all ain't paying attention to shit. That's why people come in, start talking to y'all, then they see what y'all doing and be like, shit, I ain't going back there. That's just real talk. Because it's the disrespect. That's disrespectful. I'll be honest with you. I own over 50, what, shit, over 50, 75. 75 companies right now. For me to take my time out on Wednesday to come and talk to y'all, and y'all don't pay attention to what the fuck I tell y'all, that's a smack in the face. It'd be like, all right, I see one, two, three people paying attention. When I come back, hey, make sure you get them three people. Let's grab them. Then everybody else looking with their thumb in their ass like, what the fuck, man? Like, I thought dude was going to help everybody out. Why would I help you out if you ain't paying attention to what the fuck I'm telling you to do? Or I ask you to do something you don't do it. That's why a lot of people come in, talk to y'all, and never come back. Like, I'm going to be 100 with y'all. I ain't finna blow smoke up y'all ass. I ain't going to tell y'all, oh, he, this guy going to come here and tell y'all. No, this is real shit. When you ain't paying attention and giving somebody your full attention, you just shot down your fucking opportunity. 
That's just real talk. But mothers come in here, spend their time. It's like this. It's like prime example. Let's say somebody asks one of y'all, say, man, look, I want you to go talk to this kid. But you talking to the kid, he ain't paying no attention to you. You probably got ADD jumping off the wall and shit. When you leave there, are you going to go back? Why would you? He ain't paid no attention to you. He ain't give a fuck about you. That's just real talk. Most motherfuckers make it out the hood, they don't come back because they like, man, I ain't going to deal with that bullshit. But they live the same life y'all live. They just got a pass and made it. And done. Don't even come back to the hood. Don't come to the hood to donate shit. Don't do no back to school drive. Don't do none of that shit. I do all that. I mean, I ain't here because, oh man, shit. I ain't, I gotta drag my ass over here, man, talk to them again. Oh, this was volunteer. They ain't paying me to come in and talk to y'all. And I just found out the other motherfuckers that come talk to y'all get a check. Yep. Yeah. I ain't got nothing. I ain't asked for nothing from them. I supposed to hire what, 13? How many people? What, 13? How many people are supposed to come out to the warehouse? I was supposed to be hiring. From this room? Yeah. Uh, yeah, 11 to 13. 11 to 13 people I was going to hire. If I come, from the from what I got, when I asked how did everything go, those motherfuckers bullshitting, they wasn't paying attention, they outside finna get into it. Why would I hire you for my company? I do business with Fortune 500 companies, and I send you in there to do some shit, and you laughing, joking, don't give a fuck. Like, come on. You say you want to get out of this program and you at least want to get a job to get on your feet. Give me one reason why I will hire you if you ain't paying attention to me. This is real talk. Why would I hire you? Or go into business. Or go into business apartment. with you. You don't want to listen. I sit you down in front of, and I give a prime example. Like, I sit you in front of my lawyer, uh, my other business people. We sit down. I do business with Chinese, Turkey people, Indians. I sit down with y'all and sit down with them. And they come in here and sit down and they talk and y'all doing what y'all doing. They gonna be like, oh, why the fuck did you take me there? You came from that area? Damn, you lucky. That's real shit. Cause that's all y'all here. When you see people that may like, damn, cuz you lucky you made it out the hood. I'm just giving y'all real shit, man. You seeing that shit? Yeah, man, I see it all the time, man. I asked one of my guys, no bullshit, the other day. Look, man, I'm doing this entrepreneur shit up in Roseland, man. Roseland? Nigga, I ain't going up in there. Nigga, we just got out there. What the fuck you going back talking to them for? This is real talk. Better go out here to the suburbs, donate money, give up millions to, for a better school, better environment, better streets, the whole nine. Fixing on houses, the whole nine. But ain't coming back to where they grew up at to do that. This is real talk. I'm giving y'all real shit, but... It's disrespectful for somebody to come in here and take their time out to talk to y'all. And y'all talking, y'all laughing, y'all joking and shit. Nobody coming back to help y'all. That's just real shit. That's like you ever hear like, man, when you go in classroom, what, you, what people always sit? In the back of the class. It's so they can do what the fuck they want to do. That is real talk. Nobody really come and sit in the front. You expose. Everybody see you. Like, oh, shit. Man, I don't want them asking me no motherfucking questions. So I'm sitting in the back. Like, man, like, and the only thing I can really tell y'all, like, man, look, no one in this world gonna help nobody in this fucking room or nobody in this world if you don't help yourself. No bullshit. Half of y'all probably got felons, got background, got felons, all that shit. Like you said, you're trying to get shit expunged. All that. Like, why would I help you do all that if you can't do, help me help you? I'm gonna work extra hard to make sure you become somebody in life. Fuck that, why? This is real talk. I got kids. I got a 14-year-old right now. He got eight streams of income. 14 years old. Like you could be in the same situation if you put yourself, if you, if you just push yourself. you just like, man, fuck. Yeah, I got it up here. I'm only fucking with you because I see you laughing. I got it up here. Like, come on, man. Don't nobody want to come in and hear that shit? I'm, I'm just being honest. Don't nobody, if I give you something like, man, I'm not, I don't need it. Be honest with you. I don't fucking need it. I come here to help y'all. Like, I left here, mama's asking me, like, well, you helping them? Can you help me get a company? Real shit. That's what we helping y'all do other shit. That's just real shit, man. It's like cars and shit. I got that shit. I just gave a car away the other day. I'm giving what? We, 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 a house. I'm giving the whole house away January 2018. I'm getting. Fully remodeled the whole fucking night, giving yeah, it away you, to somebody. You sad enough for <laughs> Hell no, not you. <laughs> <laughs> like, what the fuck? 
<laughs> but see, that's the thing. Like, this is the thing. Like, let's say we do. We you you work out. Say you did everything I asked you to do and shit. Mr. Rucker, look, I got a problem now. I can't get from point A to point B to even meet you. This transportation shit is killing me. Bro, I give you a fucking car. Look, this is your company, you own your company, right? I'll take you and you're gonna put the car in your company name. That's it. And I'm gonna be real shit, I'm gonna show y'all how real shit I am. He did his fucking assignment, right? I'ma fuck with you. Just to piss you off. Real shit. So you gotta have your shit. You gotta have your shit together, real talk. You say you seven seven fifty. He ain't from Chicago. He ain't. He ain't from Chicago. He he ain't. I'm comfortable. I'm comfortable. I'm comfortable. That's just real shit, y'all. Like y'all just got a man. Y'all got y'all got more than that, But see that's small shit. That's small shit, real shit. That's small shit. That's how I wanna talk. Shit, since he came here. Yeah, since he came here. You from Chicago, huh? You from Chicago. You from Chicago. He's still figuring it out. Yeah, Language and shit. Well, he meant you. But I, I can see it in a lot of y'all. Y'all got it, man. It's just like, Actually, we got to get somebody to introduce us. Introduce us uh, to each mm-hmm. other. He had a clothing line. I had a clothing line at the mm-hmm. time. And uh, that's how we became cool and shit. Off of that. I was still doing my thing. I was still doing my. I ain't gonna lie when I met you. You're in the fucking clothing line, like shit. Six stores. Yeah, we was in stores in uh, Philly, New York, uh, Chicago. Um, we had uh, we provided the clothes for Waka Flocka. Uh, ben. Ben one. I mean. He just called him too. We gotta hit him back. What do I do? Yeah, like natural. Like natural. I mean, I help, you know, bring money to businesses. Do you like his financial advisor? Nah, we do mostly sales and marketing for yeah. these companies. Basically, assist. Hmm? Nah, he gotta do all the marketing and development. I, I'm whatever you want, bro. Motherfucker could be the goddamn janitor. Long we eat, I don't give a fuck. See, titles don't mean nothing to me. You know? right, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's like, you know, you can say CEO, that's cool. You can say custodian, I don't give a shit. Know you, you know too. what I mean? That's my company. Okay. That answer your question? Yeah. As long as they answer your question. <laughs> you didn't ask the question, he did. As long as they answer your question, you come. That, that makes you happy. Like, as long as they answer your question. Like, that's just real shit. You was professional? I said, I'm professional. I ain't gonna lie. I can't remember where I got into it. That shit always took me. No ass. Long as you want, but see, that's all I want. Look. Look, real shit. I'm gonna be honest. Like, if you honest with me, that's all I ask for. You know what I'm saying? Don't bullshit me. Don't, don't, oh yeah, it's in my head. Don't give me no, no excuses and shit. Just be 100 with me. You know what I'm saying? They ain't told us when we was going. I think we going somewhere else. Yeah, little lady just talking. Y'all thought y'all was on a field trip and shit? I ain't know what we're going on. I don't 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 but that's the thing. You never know when the house You gotta always be prepared. You gotta be prepared. You stand married? Oh shit, that's right. So get a. I'm shaking about his motherfucking ass. Him, him, him right here in the hat. Him in the back. Oh, that's all it was. 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 Oh, that's all it was.
So you just going to let me know. Somebody does come up to you at the gas station and he asks you to spit a hot 16. Who do you blow his head off? When it, and then he signs you up and be like, come down, I work for Def Jam, here's your opportunity. This is the same thing. This dude is saying, hey, who wants to own their own company? I just picked it up. I don't know how many cats came in here that asked you guys that. One of the person who was that, we were talking about right here or something? One, hey, who else got a time? Need more than one even with working with you. That's what we're talking about. You know, they ain't never came back or whatever. I ain't saying nothing about it. So, yeah. it's, like, it's, like, it's, like, it's like how it is in the hood. You know, people yeah. say, I'm going to keep fucking with you guys. Yeah. Yeah. So, all y'all know Cervante, right? Yeah. 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 Do y'all know how plugged that nigga is? Oh, yeah. That's yeah. my life coach. But that nigga yeah. plugged. Oh. Hey, now there's a lot of people. I thought he was going to do that, not plug. <laughs> no, no, not, not, <laughs> not weight plug. But I'm talking about he knows celebrity. Like, he fall backward and land no celebrity. That's how plug he is. He's, he's sitting here. Oh, you guys know how to. Y'all need to pay attention. Because I talk to him.